Hey guys, what's going on? Retro here, and I'm back with another TF2 commentary, and today I will be talking about some exciting news and updates in the Team Fortress 2 community, which is basically actually only going to be one specific topic, which is going to be competitive TF2. But before I jump to that exciting news, I want to let you guys know that a good friend of mine, Monkey, which you may or may not have seen before on Twitch, is hosting an awesome raffle on Scrap.TF for a Circling Hearts Kong Kong Cone, which is obviously as you guys know the best hat in the game which was unboxed by him and all you gotta do to enter is be a follower on his twitch and enter the raffle via scrap.tf which you will have to link your twitch account with and all the links to that will be linked down below and on another note I need your guys help on one of my upcoming videos can't really explain what it is yet since I would like to be it to since I would like for it to be a surprise but it would be great if you guys could help me out by just answering a simple question and all you have to do is there will be a link in the description below with a where it goes to a Google form where there's just one question and all you have to do is just answer that question however you feel I guess is the correct answer and that will help me out so much for my for an upcoming video so that would be great if you guys could go fill that out now on to the awesome news of confirmed Team Fortress 2 competitive matchmaking and ranks built into the actual game so I know a lot of people have been saying that Team Fortress 2 is dying, it's been a trend lately that trading's dying, earbuds are dead, and the economy is dead, no one plays the game anymore and all sorts of things like that. But I do feel like this is the update that we have been waiting for and could be the savior of Team Fortress 2. And just an update in general since we didn't really get anything lately uh, update wise, anything actually meaningful since we got the end line disaster and our normal every year Christmas update with reskinned weapons and stuff like that. And we're already into May of 2015 and we really have not gotten anything at all. So it is a bit late for TF2 since CSGO has had competitive since day one, but this could make a huge difference I think in the economy. Not in the economy, but just the entire community in general. But so. A few days ago, folks from XTV met with Valve and Valve told them about this new matchmaking update and how it was a high priority project which is basically means it's going to be probably the next update we're going to see in Team Fortress 2. So as many of you guys probably know, CSGO is huge in the competitive scene with it having a built in matchmaking system with all whole bunch of different ranks dividing up players depending on their skill level and it being a professional eSport, I guess, if that's what you want to call it. But Valve has said they're going to implement a similar mode into Team Fortress 2 with ranks and matchmaking and all sorts of stuff like that. Now, I'm totally stoked for this since I've recently begun in, into some comp TF2 via TF2 Center where you can join different lobbies and play 9v9 or 6v6 and I've also played a few seasons of UGC Highlander in the past. Now it'll be interesting to see how they will determine your rank or what options will be available in competitive mode since there's the classic 9v9 Highlander where it's one class of each or the 6v6 two scout, um, two, uh, two soldiers, a demo and a med. And I'll be sure to make a video once this comes out which is supposedly supposed to be around June or July but it's gonna be absolutely amazing I'm so hyped for this hopefully we'll maybe we'll get an update in between this and I guess competitive maybe we'll get the spy and ng update maybe that'll be part of it I don't know that'd be absolutely amazing since you know I main spy but all all we know for sure is that there's gonna be a wonderful update for Team Fortress 2 we're gonna have ranks and no, I will not be a silver for life. And I remember when I made a CSGO video back then, people were like, oh, you're a silver noob. And I just want to let you guys know, I have ranked up and I have become a gold Nova 3. Woo, out of silver. Still, it's pretty low, but better than nothing. Can't wait till this comes out. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of news and updates, which was basically only one topic since there sadly hasn't been much in Team Fortress 2. But this is going to be a big, big topic until it actually comes out so this will be what's floating around and what's on everyone's mind if I guess you're looking forward to it and if not that's fine that's fine but be sure to check out monkey's raffle 
all the links will be down in the description below and also be sure to fill out that question which the link will also be down below for one of my upcoming videos and let me know what you guys think of competitive TF2 do you think it's going to be the update that will save the game or do you just not want it at all I'd love to hear you guys feedback and this is Retro Sign Off